Hello, it's me. I'm not quite in the UK at the moment, so I'm making a video that's a little bit different. Should drones be allowed to fly over UK theme parks? Every year at close season, a handful of people decide to go to either Fort Park or Alton Towers and take their drone over the park to see what's going on inside. The excuses, you know, are oh, the rides aren't running, the park's closed, it's safe, it's fine. And I mean, technically it's legal, you know, the Alton Towers or Fort Park don't actually own the airspace over the theme park. But just because something's legal doesn't really mean you have to go out and do it. Because these theme parks have been quite vocal about not wanting people to fly their drones over the theme park. I mean, Fort Park literally spent, I don't know how much, on loads of signage plastered all around the fencing and around the outside of the park saying, no, please don't fly your drones. Like, they've clearly gone to some length to print all that signage basically to say, don't fly your drones, please. It's not a legal sign because they don't have any legal right to tell you no, but it's clearly them saying, we really don't want you doing this. And I feel like that should be respected. Now, this year has seen a lot more people going out there with their drones and taking them over the theme park, which clearly suggests that, you know, once you po start posting that stuff online, it inspires other people to go and try and get their own shots in a similar way, which I worry could lead to people flying their drones over the park when it's actually open. That could be quite scary. But just touching on the legal side again, Whilst the airspace over the parks might be legal to fly your drone, how the flight is conducted may not be legal. And this is all speculation. This isn't me accusing anyone directly or any, of anything. But I've seen some photos online of people flying their drones directly over the Alton Towers lawns and over the towers themselves. And by law, as a drone pilot, you have to keep your drone in visual line of sight. Meaning where you control the drone from, you have to have direct vision with your drone in the sky. Now I've been flying drones long enough to know about visual line of sight quite well. And I don't think anywhere you could take your drone off from outside of Alton Towers, you would have clear visual line of sight to the drone if you're flying it over the towers from any of the surrounding roads. So that's a question of whether the flights are actually legal or not uh, that are taking place over the parks. Now, I don't want to send any hate to any of the accounts that are posting drone stuff. I just wanted to share my opinion on the situation because if you know me, you know I've been vocal on this in the past on social media. So that's my standpoint. That's my explanation of it. I just think we should have a bit more respect for the parks if they don't want people doing it. And that's it for this bit of a different video from southern France in this lovely little village. If you liked it, uh, then please consider liking or subscribing. My videos aren't normally like this. They're normally a bit more exciting and travel based. So make sure to drop a sub to see that. I've gone completely dark. I'm in the shade now. <laughs> anyway. I'll see you in the next video. Thanks guys, bye bye.